Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. For those of you who are new and who don't know me, hi, my name is Mallory and I am a college sophomore at Wilmington University in Delaware. I decided that today I would do a planner tour plan with me kind of video. I just got a new planner and I have been waiting to like write anything in it until I did this video. So I've been like going crazy because I've been wanting to transfer all of my stuff into my new planner, but I'm like, no, I want to wait to do it for the video. So yeah, I'm finally doing it today. This is my old planner. It is the 2018 Bohemian Deluxe Planner and I got this from Barnes and Noble. I actually get this same one like every year because I love the way that it's laid out and I haven't seen any other planner like it before. So with that being said, this is my new planner. It is the exact same planner, but obviously 2019 and it has a different, you know, um, oh, I still have this thing on there. Probably get rid of that. It just has like a different pattern, you know, for the new year, but I love this planner. I get this every year. Like I said, it's from Barnes and Noble and it's design is by Susan Winget, W-I-N-G-E-T. I don't know how to pronounce that. So yeah, but this is my favorite planner and I'm just gonna show you guys how I plan out my week, plan out my month. Like I said, I am in college, so I have a lot going on and it's important to keep everything put together, everything organized. All right, so here is the planner in all of its glory and just a quick tour. It just has like general information and then this stuff, which I don't really use. And then it actually starts in August. So I'm just gonna start, you know, where I left off in my other planner. So it has the month laid out here and then it has like each week like this. And what I really like about this planner is that it has all of the days here. I don't like it when they like put Saturday and Sunday together, just in like anything, like I hate that. I like having Saturday and Sunday. So it has all the days and then it also has a to-do list in the middle. So things that I have to do throughout the week that aren't on a specific day, I'll usually put like here. So like laundry, you know, whenever I have to do laundry or cleaning my room, which is like once a week. So I'll put all that stuff here. Anyways, it just has all of that, all the months. And then at the end of the, planner it actually has stickers which i never use so today is friday november 16th and it's actually my dad's birthday so dad if you're watching this happy birthday but yeah first of all i'm just going to take everything from my old planner and just transfer it into here so i'm gonna do that really quick this part and then like the actual like day part for the week that i'm on right now all right so i just copied everything onto the november calendar and i just decided to do the whole month because i like the way it looks better i don't like it like just starting off like here and like nothing up here so i just did the whole month the way that i do this is i will write down things that i have to like be at kind of so like class i have to go to class at a certain time or if i'm going to the gym or if i have like a meeting or i'm hanging out with a friend just like stuff that i like go out and do so that's everything i write down here also if i want to like film or upload videos i will put that here as well and just like birthdays and stuff like that like for today i have my dad's birthday and then the gym which i went to this morning and then i'm meeting my parents and my sister for dinner at six so i put that here so that's kind of how i do like the calendar part and then for the day part i didn't bother with the first few weeks of november i just went straight to this week so for this week i do the same thing so whatever is on the day of this for the calendar i would write here so like places that i have to be or like anything like that so that's all right here i also have trash right here because tuesday is trash day so it like reminds me to put out the trash cans and then vlog and get my second of the day and then this is what i like the most about this planner is that i can put everything that i have to do this week right here and then cross it off as i do it so like wash sheets i did that like I don't know, Tuesday or something, laundry, clean, homework, grocery shopping, film, like all of that stuff I'll put here. And then as I do it, I cross it off. So by the end of the week, everything's crossed off. That's kind of how I work, like this part of my planner. And then whenever something comes up, I will just either write it here or I will write it, you know, if it's a certain day, then I'll go to that tape and then I'll go to that day and write it there. Oh my God, I can't talk. <laughs> now I'm just going to go into next week and write down things I have to do next week. So like Monday, I have class from 5.30 to 10.30, long five hour class. And then Thursday is actually Thanksgiving. So I have, I actually have two Thanksgivings this year. I have Thanksgiving on Thanksgiving, like dinner. 
um, with my team and my family. And then on Saturday, I actually have another Thanksgiving dinner with my cousins and my grandparents because they can't come up until Friday, I believe. So we have two dinners for that. And then the next week I have class again on Monday. And then Tuesday, I'm actually going to a Flyers game, which is gonna be really fun. So I have that and the bus leaves at 3.45, so I'm gonna go ahead and write that down. Class on Thursday, and I actually have an exam on this day. So I'll put in parentheses, parentheses, exam right there. And then Friday, I have a race, a 5K, the reindeer run. And I'm actually in Hershey Park, uh, Pennsylvania, with Anushka. So I'll put Hershey Park with Anushka right there PA and I'm actually seeing the weekend so I just draw a little arrow so I made it through the whole year and I'm in January now I copied everything from my old planner onto this one so my old planner can go in the trash now done with that so now I'm gonna plan out January a little bit so classes um, work uh, for volleyball, tennis, like all of that kind of stuff. Now the way I do this is I actually have six categories for like planning and organizing everything, like six categories of my life basically, I guess you could call it that. I have school, which is the first one, and so like this includes homework, classes, exams, like studying, everything that has to do with school. Next I have work slash jobs, so like volleyball, I'll put down when I'm working for volleyball and like tournaments and stuff. Once once I figure out when the tournaments are, I'll put those, but for now I can just put the practice times because I know that. Um, I also have working out slash sports, so tennis, traveling for tennis, going to the gym, all of that. I have social, so like hanging out with friends or like going to the movies or anything like that. YouTube, so filming, uploading, editing. And then I also have life slash other, which is like laundry, cleaning, appointments, grocery shopping, all of that fun stuff. So that's kind of how I organize everything. So I'm going to go ahead and do January right now. All right, so I wrote out a few things that I know I have in January. So like birthdays, I have my birthday and Camila's birthday here. And then I also have all of my classes because I already registered for them. So I know when they are. And then I also have um, practice for volleyball for my job. I'm, I didn't put anything for tennis yet because I don't know anything for that. So like this is all I know for now, but as you know, we get the schedules and stuff and practice and like matches and all that, then I'll start putting that in, but it is like only November, so I only know a few things right now. But yeah, that's pretty much how I plan everything. I use those categories that I was talking about, like the six categories, like every day to make sure that I do everything and that I don't forget anything that I have to do. Uh, so yeah, that's pretty much how I plan everything and how I use my planner. I'm really excited to have a fresh new start with the new planner. I'm going to say goodbye to my old one. That's always a tough time because I love my planners, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. All right, so that was it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you liked it, then be sure to hit that subscribe button and stay tuned for more videos. Let me, let me try that again. So that was it for this video. I hope you guys liked it. If you want to see more videos from me, hit that subscribe button. And I also have a vlog channel where I vlog pretty much every day and I'm doing Vlogmas, which is really exciting. So if you want to check that out, I will have it at the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed and I will talk to you all in my next video. Mm -hmm.